The Democratic Republic of Congo's election is already two years overdue. And the Electoral Commission has announced the second postponement in a week in three areas. The elections in Beni, Butembo and Yumbi, initially planned for December 30th, are now programmed for March 2019 and will be subject to a specific calendar. The Electoral Commission said the three areas would have delayed parliamentary polls and provincial elections in March. But that means they'll be completely excluded from the presidential poll that's meant to happen on Sunday. And the Electoral Commission said the reason was conflicts and an Ebola outbreak. All three areas are key opposition strongholds. And this is one of the reasons why. Hundreds of civilians have been killed in a series of massacres around the town of Beni in the last four years. It's not clear who's behind them. The government blames a rebel group called the ADF. The Ebola outbreak started in August and spread to the area around Beni. More than 300 people have died. But campaign rallies were allowed to take place there. And it's opposition candidate Martin Fayulu who drew the biggest crowds. I think this is the people that need change in this country most because they've been under wars, wars, war atrocities and mass killing since the decade. And they also want their vote counts a lot in this country. They also want to change. There are about 1.2 million voters in the regions that will be excluded. Many of them support Fayulu. Congo's Catholic Church, which has played a key role in campaigning for democracy, also questioned the decision. We think this is a dangerous decision, and also we don't see a clear motivation for it. Why did they not decide this during the campaign, when people were more exposed? Why only now? I think there is a hidden agenda behind it. The election has been repeatedly postponed. Opposition and their millions of followers now question its credibility too. Even if it happens, its result may not be accepted. Malcolm Webb, Al Jazeera, Kinshasa, in the Democratic Republic of Congo.